to do another haul for you guys, a try on haul. I got some stuff from Romley and it is super freaking cute as always. Um, I know that you guys love when I do hauls and I honestly love doing hauls because I love clothes. I don't know why I just feel like the need to disclaim this. I feel like I've been doing a lot of hauls recently, but I love hauls. And in case I haven't been completely open about this before, these clothes were gifted to me, but I am in no way sponsored or are in no way being told what to say. These are my honest opinions, but I just felt I needed to put a disclaimer because I haven't done it in a while. These clothes were gifted to me. With that being said, let's get into the haul. Now, the first couple items that I got are larger items because I got them to share with my mom. When I was picking out my clothes on Romwe, she was here with me and she was pointing out things that were cute and I decided to surprise her and get her some things that I thought she could share with me and that we could both wear. So the first thing that I got her, which is super freaking cute and I'm thinking about sealing it for myself, is this like olive green hoodie, but it's not just a normal hoodie. It has this cool like asymmetrical hemline on the front. You'll see it in the try-on. It's freaking rad. And I like it a lot. It's super oversized. This is a size large, and I would say this looks true to size to an American size large. So this will definitely fit my mom, and it definitely fits me. So yeah, I'm super excited about that. I have this jacket in a tan color, and when my mom was here, she absolutely fell in love with it. So I decided to order another one in a different color so that we could both wear them at the same time, but not be twins. <laughs> because I already look enough like my mom, I don't need to actually look like her younger twin sister. So, it is this big, fluffy, teddy bear jacket. It is black on the outside, white on the inside. It's so cozy, it just snaps up in the front. It has this big, oversized, like raw hem look to it and I like it. Although we placed this order about two weeks ago and it was really cold but now it's like 80 degrees outside so this will probably go into storage until it's actually cold again. <laughs> and this next thing when my mom said she liked it I was like you're crazy but then it came and I actually put it on with like a white t-shirt and some blue jeans and some sandals and it actually is pretty freaking cute. I would normally never pick something out like this, but I really like it. This is from the plus size range at Romney, so this is a 1XL. So for my thick gals, we got this. Look at this. This is so freaking cute. It's like this, um, my mom really likes these and I used to really like them. Um, it's like a, it's like a kimono thing. Well, that's what they call it in stores anyways. And it's like a, it's like a, a bat winged cardigan basically. I really like it. It's super colorful. Um, but like I don't have many colorful things in my wardrobe. So I could get some use out of that when I'm like wearing an all monochromatic outfit. Just throw on a pop of color. We looking gla glad? We looking glad. <laughs> Good rad. Glad. Now moving on to some things that are a little bit more my style. I got this super adorable jean jacket and it's just this like completely coated jean jacket on the inside with this super soft, oh my god, it's even lined in the arms. That is so rare because like usually when you buy cheap jackets online um, from like other websites, they aren't lined in the arms. They're fuzzy all on here but not in the arms. Then when you go outside, you're like, why are my arms cold? So this is really nice. It's lined in the arms. I freaking love that. And just on the front of it, it has this thing. I don't know what it says. I couldn't read it on the website. So I was like, I'll read it when it comes. Still can't read it. I can't read fonts. Someone please tell me what this says. I don't care what it says. It's freaking cute. Is there anything else embroidered on it? No. Oh, I love this. It's so nice quality. This is such nice quality. Oh, it would look so cute with this shirt. Mm. Living cute love. Next thing I got is a pair of black side stripe leggings. I was craving some black side stripe. Side I was craving some black side striped leggings and I am glad that they are finally in my life. I needed these so bad. Two weeks ago I just suddenly was like, I need those and now they're here. I love the internet. Good quality, uh, not like an athletic waistband. These definitely aren't like workout leggings, they're just like leisure leggings, but I'm down to leisure. On the complete opposite spectrum of like 
athleisure wear. <laughs> I have always been on the lookout for a certain style of black leather jacket, but it has to be vegan because I would never buy a real leather jacket. And I saw this one on Romwe, and it is in a size one, whatever that means. <laughs> And you'll see it better in the try-on haul, but it just looks like this. The only thing that I didn't like about it is this belt at the bottom because it makes a jingly noise and I don't like to make such a big announcement when I walk into a room. But it's removable, so I can just remove that. I can actually use that as a belt from my pants if I really wanted to. But now I just have the perfect, like, leather moto jacket. And I love it. It goes right to the top of my pants. It's perfect size. It doesn't make my shoulders or arms look bulky. I love it. I just, I'd wear it right now if it wasn't actually 80 degrees. Oh my gosh. Do you see how it doesn't add like any bulk to my, well, when I raise my arms up, obviously it adds bulk to my shoulders, but like it doesn't add any bulk to my arms. It's the perfect length on my arms. It is perfect. I don't know why I'm showing you this. You'll see it in the try on haul but it's freaking amazing. In my last haul, I bought some, my last haul? Ew. In my last haul, I bought some trouser pants. Um, I feel weird just calling them trousers. I don't know why I feel like I need to call them trouser pants, but I love them. They are pajamas you can wear out of the house that are f actually like formal, is this pair. And the, these, and both of these I believe are one size fits all. Um, so I don't think that's really a problem in the waist because look at how freaking this stretches. It's probably just a problem in the length because these are quite short. For me, they're fine but I can imagine on anyone who's taller than 5'3", these being too short. But they just look like this, and I just had it. They come with a little belt, and like obviously they have belt loops, so you just like belt it, and they're supposed to look like wrap pants, even though they aren't. <laughs> but these are just like this pin stripey material. Wouldn't necessarily wear it with this shirt, but it could look fire with like a black or white shirt. Mmm, in love. Now this next one is more of like a trouser jumpsuit type thing. Um, it just looks like this and it has this like deep V in the front and it's this like gingham plaid pattern. I think that's the word for it. And it is just like a trouser bottom. I haven't yet to try this exact piece on yet so I'm not sure how it will fit me, but I have high hopes that it'll be cute. I've never really tried anything like this before, so sometimes because of my body shape, I have kind of like a pear body shape. These type of garments make me look pregnant, but sometimes it's okay to look pregnant. <laughs> Take a little detour from the clothes for a sec and go into some accessories because I got a pair of glasses and two pairs of shoes. Little backstory, when my mom was here the other day, I tried on her bifocal glasses. And obviously the bottom part, the bifocal, is like really blurry and crazy. But I was like, oh, so the top part doesn't do anything. And then she was like, no. And then I went outside and I could see the trees. Did you know tree branches have individual leaves and you can see them from far away? I didn't. Yeah, I found out I need glasses, but I don't know what style of real glasses I'm gonna actually get. So I'm trying out some cool glasses and I decided to get these to see what they look like. Um, these are cute. I don't know. What do you guys think? I'm gonna do a whole video like choosing my new glasses for like later in the future once I like get my prescription and everything. But yeah, I think these are rad. These are cute. Probably gonna end up popping the lenses out of these though because they're not anti-glare and you can see my ring light and my window and that's just not cute. I don't like that. Oh my God. So, oh my God, Becky. I got the cutest pair of running shoes ever, ever. I'm Hefner. And I cannot even believe that these are real and that I own them. They look like this. They're these blue, light baby blue, flower embroidered running shoes. These are so cute. Like this with like some mom jeans, some socks, a freaking yellow shirt, my, my, my flip flip, my little yellow backpack. Like I haven't worn these outside so this is not gross. This is so cute. I got them in a size 39 if anyone is wondering. I'd size up though because they are a little bit snug but that's kind of good for shoes like this. You don't want them like slipping off but so freaking cute plant mom aesthetic shoes give me yes i don't have any tennis shoes and i am going on a trip where i'm gonna want to wear like comfy like white t-shirts striped side leggings and workout shoes but i wanted some nikes but i couldn't afford any because they are expensive for me only probably gonna wear them like 
twice a month because I don't work out. <laughs> Ooh, these shoes, they look like this. They just look like a classic running shoe. They have like memory foam in the back of the heel and like the tongue is like memory foam. So when you like squeeze it, it's like, Mm. Ooh, yes, feels good. I don't know, man. These are just really good quality shoes. These are also in a size, these are in a size five. If you are insecure about your feet size, <laughs> get these because these definitely are not a US size five because I am a seven and I fit into these. <laughs> That's so funny. Cute, 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 cute. Look at these, I am a runner. Not really. <laughs> the next thing I got to wear underneath that trouser thing, and it is just this lettuce hem, long sleeved, like turtlenecked shirt. And it is like tight and cropped, freaking adorable, if I do say so myself. And I just needed this, it's a basic piece. I can wear it tucked into jeans, I can wear it with a lot of things. Super freaking cute. I am a bodysuit noob. I did not like the idea of bodysuits for the longest time because you have to take your entire body off to pee. And I'm not about that life. I wanna be in and out. I don't wanna take 30 minutes. I was thinking about this today. Guys are so lucky. They don't have to untuck their shirt to pee. Like I had gotten all dressed today. I had tucked my shirt in perfectly to my jeans, put my belt on and I was like, oh, I gotta pee. I had to undo my belt. I take my shirt out of my pants. I'm like, a guy can just like not do that. And I'm like, I'm so jealous. You never have to untuck your shirt once you tuck it in the mirror. It never feels the same. It never looks as good. Anyways, <laughs> I got this bodysuit. I've been really into like blazers and like the look of blazers. This is super sexy now that I look at it. I, I do not know how I'm going to wear this without popping a tit. <laughs> but I, I don't know, I haven't tried this, this one on yet, but it's just this like open uh, blazer type bodysuit. And I was like, this will tuck itself into my pants. I won't have to tuck it in because it'll do it itself. I don't know. I thought it was kind of fancy and that it might come in handy on vacation if I go to a nice restaurant or something, or if I'm invited to like a nice party or something at some point, I will have that. Unless it's boobtastic, then it'll be saved for the club. <laughs> The last things I have are two pairs of pants and uh, I got these super cute velvety like tracky bottom open leg pants. Um, and I saw a picture of Cami Scott, the YouTuber uh, here on YouTube, wearing a pair of pants exactly like this with like a Gucci bag and a white shirt. And I'm like, I need that. So I got these pants, they're not exactly the same. I think hers were green, but I like red better. So this is super cute with like a white little like lettuce hem shirt and like my little backpack and some sneaks. So cute. Seriously, someone count how many times I said cute in this video. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I had just watched one of Cami Scott's videos after when, when I, before I placed this order. So this next pair of pants is also something similar to ones that I saw her wearing and they just look like this. I saw her wearing a pair of pants that had these front seams. I've seen a lot of people wearing these pants actually with these front seams recently. So I got a pair. Oops, my the fly is down. Woo! But yeah, I haven't tried these on yet. They look a little large, but I kind of wanted them to be kind of baggy, so that is good. My foot is asleep. Ow! Ugh. Ow, my foot's asleep. Ugh. Okay guys, that is it for this video and I hope you enjoyed it. If you watched to this point in the haul because this was a long one, please comment below what item I got was your favorite. And of course, if you liked any of these enough to buy them, I don't make any money by the way, if you guys buy the links in the description, obviously. Um, but yeah, I just, I really like Romwe's clothes. They, over the years, when I first started buying stuff from Romwe, cause yes, in the beginning, I would buy things from Romwe to do my hauls, to now, when I get them given to me, their quality has skyrocketed to Forever 21 H&M quality, but for a way cheaper price. Some of the stuff you can even find at Forever 21, just with the Forever 21 logo soon in it, and I'm like, I could've got that off Romwe for six bucks, but no, you're 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 charging 39, what? Um, so yeah, you know, it's a good bargain. But if it's your first time seeing my videos, please remember to subscribe by clicking the subscribe button. And if you actually like this video, please remember to like it by clicking the thumbs up. If you were subscribed already and you have not yet, click the bell to turn on my notifications so you are notified when I post, so you can actually enjoy my content. <laughs> so thanks for watching, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys, Fwah. Bye.